Why doesn't Islam allow homosexuality as it is found in nature? Now, this question has become a major question amongst former Muslims who choose to be homosexual and leave Islam, or some people who choose to be homosexual or carry out their homosexual inclinations and still claim to be Muslim. They ask, why does Islam not allow homosexuality when it is found in nature, it is a natural desire? The response to this is that homosexuality is a desire, a male for a male or a female for a female. Sexuality or sexual desire has been placed inside of the human being for procreation. This is the purpose. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has created human beings as such that if Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala did not place sexual desire in human beings, they will not procreate. Why will the woman put up with a man and why will the man put up with a woman? So Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala created this desire in them. So they will tolerate one another and procreate. This desire, some people some men and some women do not have this desire for the opposite sex, opposite gender. Some of them will claim that they have desire for the same gender. Others will have a desire for children, which is known as pedophilia. Others will have a desire for animals, which is known as bestiality. Others will have even a desire for dead bodies, which is known as, what is it known as? Necrophilia. So all these different desires, where do we draw the line? And who draws the line? So Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala legislated marriage between man and woman. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala legislated marriage between man and woman. And Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala told us all these other desires which people may have are prohibited. This is why the Quran has prohibited homosexuality. And unfortunately, there are groups of people who have attempted to validate homosexuality in Islam. They are unable to do so. And even those people who have chosen this as a way of life, Again, I say to them that they must dialogue with us, come to these type of gatherings, discuss with us, present their doubts regarding this issue, and we will respond to this uh, accordingly. But in short, this is uh, the response to them.